last time. Yeah, then you don't have to be there. I've been teaching robotics for about a year. Give me two of these. Let's see what you guys have over here. Hold on. I'm really, really enjoying it. I like working with the kids. All right, we got all four. Put on the floor. My name is Xavier Eldridge. I am 23, fifth year senior now at University of Houston downtown. A small one goes on there. We're like building robots. I'm just teaching the basics. I want them to learn the basic concepts of how robots go together and such. Once they've learned those, they go to the next level. I've always had those few kids, like, I've never done robotics before. I don't know what exactly I'm doing here. I was like, just take your time. The instructions are pretty detailed. I'll just follow the instructions. Once you built the ro robot, just have fun with it. Go. Yeah. This right now is building teamwork working how to work with others. A lot of students are shy, they don't like to talk, but I've seen a lot of students that are like real quiet that come in and once they start working on the robot, it starts opening them up and they start communicating well with others. So when they get back to school, they'll go back to school with these team working abilities and skills that will help them work better in the classroom when they have to do group projects and do presentations in front of people. A lot of the kids, they enjoy it because it's something fun, it's different. It's not every day you get to say, hey, I'm going to go build a robot for two hours. Oh, hold up, look, look, hold up. That's awesome. If it gets them more into school, that's great. I hope so. Eventually down the line, somebody, like, you know, comes up and is like, this new engineer invents the next hover car, or next phone, or something like that, that we all end up using. It'd be nice to know that I actually helped them out when they was a little kid. Beat them down! Beat them down! Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're off the table. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah.